It's time for hot news around the world. San Antonio. The church has grown from 304 in January to over 340 members. There are now 62 campus disciples, and the church recently targeted College Station, Texas for 2012. Daytona Beach, South Florida will be sending out Florida's first church planting in 10 years. The inaugural service will be on January 10th, 2010. Mexico, where the Mexican church has just finished a leadership conference representing the 27 churches nationwide. Meeting for the first time in three years, they left more unified than ever and more resolved to win Mexico for Christ. Mexico City, by the way, gave 22 times their weekly contribution in their mission offering recently. Boston. It's a big turnaround in Boston as the church has grown 4% this year and all their regions are growing. Brazil. The São Paulo church grew for the second year in a row. And down the road in Rio de Janeiro, they hired on full-time leadership recently and they're now having weekly baptisms. Russia. The South Russian Leadership Conference just wrapped up. The churches are unified and fired up. They also took up an awesome special contribution to send out new churches. Bangladesh. Dinesh George reports that 50 disciples had over 300 at church to hear Douglas Jacobi. All that in a Muslim nation in the midst of civil turmoil. It was a huge success. Hong Kong, where the teens have had 50 baptisms in the last two years. Guatemala. The church has had almost 100 baptisms this year. Our Guatemala City congregation continues to grow. Los Angeles. It's their third consecutive year of growth in Los Angeles. Over 600 were baptized and restored in 2009. That's 5% growth, and that's very encouraging. Also, John Causey told us about the downtown region planted this year. They've grown from 92 to 135 members. And finally, Randy Jordan tells us that over 20 churches now have raised $260,000 of support for Hope Worldwide for their International Day of Giving in November. That's all the good news for now. We'll see you back at ICOC Hot News for constant updates.